This presentation will introduce you to CompSim's KEEL technology. KEEL stands for Knowledge Enhanced Electronic Logic. I want to start by differentiating the term technology from a tool. We suggest that a technology provides a way to solve a problem. With KEEL, the problem we are trying to solve is to provide a new way to process information. More specifically, we are attempting to process information in a way similar to how a human applies judgment and reasoning. We suggest that this ability to exercise reasoning has been what has separated humans from computers in the past. Human experts utilize judgment and reasoning when they dispense their expertise. It is the expert's ability to interpret information and balance alternatives that provides value beyond just following a simple set of rules. A tool facilitates the implementation of a technology. For example, a hammer facilitates the bonding of pieces of wood. A high-resolution printing tool facilitates the manufacture of integrated circuits. With Keel, we have software tools that allow us to capture and test the way that a domain expert interprets information and balances alternatives. More specifically, we have the Keel Toolkit that incorporates a dynamic graphical language. We suggest that this type of graphical language maps closely to the way that a human's right brain interprets information and balances alternatives. The characteristics of the Keel language allow the user to see how information is interpreted and see how the system balances alternatives. Now I want to focus on what we mean by reasoning. This slide shows the functionality of the two hemispheres of the human brain. With this segmentation, the left brain equates to the functionality commonly provided with conventional von Neumann digital computers. Language, rules, numbers are handled with if-then-else logic. Information is processed sequentially. The right brain has to do with the interpretation of information. The relative importance of different pieces of information can be managed by analog logic. Judgment and reasoning have to do with the interpretation and integration of multiple pieces of information. In analog systems, like the human right brain, information is processed in parallel. The human is often challenged by allocating resources across conflicting goals. For example, spending money for short-term enjoyment versus saving money for long-term plans. The human must consider all activities in parallel because they cannot be addressed in isolation. It may not be acceptable to expend all resources for a short-term problem when the future will still have to be addressed. Now we want to focus on how Keel technology provides support for reasoning. Using the Keel toolkit, we define how information is to be valued in a dynamic environment. A domain expert can usually do this without requiring support from mathematicians or software engineers. The domain expert uses his or her experience to identify the decisions and actions that can be performed. Then the domain expert identifies the pieces of information that are used to make those decisions or to exercise control in the form of actions. These are the inputs to the system. Finally, the domain expert defines the functional relationships between data items using common drag and drop techniques. The dynamic nature of the Keel dynamic graphical language allows domain experts to get immediate feedback on how the system responds. The Keel engine is automatically being generated behind the scenes and is active as soon as data items are dropped on the display. The domain expert can stimulate the inputs to the system and see how it responds. Changes are made in seconds, not hours or weeks or years. The designs are completely explainable and auditable because it is easy to see how the information is interpreted under any input scenario. The Keel cognitive engines support the need for systems to be adaptive to change. Conventional logic handles the plans and general rules. The Keel engines are called when the systems need to adapt. This might be triggered by new events or change of state. The Keel engine could also be periodically called or in some cases the interpretation of information might be continuous or continuous for a short period of time. Many times there is value in integrating human-like reasoning into devices. For example, autonomous vehicles will be expected to pursue goals on their own. They will be expected to handle a changing environment 
and adapt in real time. Keel technology is a good fit for embedded real-time applications. The Keel engines are high-performance functions that require very little memory. Since the problems addressed with Keel functions are captured as table data, not sequential code, they occupy very little memory space that might be limited in embedded products. In summary, Keel can effectively be used any place where there is value in integrating human-like reasoning into devices or software applications. The Keel Dynamic Graphical Language addresses lifecycle cost concerns by making it relatively easy to address complex nonlinear systems. Decisions and actions made by Keel engines are completely explainable and auditable, making them suitable for safety critical systems. The small memory footprint of the Keel engines and their high performance makes Keel suitable for many embedded applications. Keel technology is covered by a series of granted patents. It is only available from CompSim. If you would like more information, there are numerous papers and demonstrations of Keel technology on CompSim's website, www.compsim.com.